Here's another quick simple practice tip that might really help you out. If you're familiar with simple practice, you know they have a template library where they have all sorts of intake forms, assessments, some really good stuff that's in there. However, once you choose one of these templates, it's labeled either as an intake, an assessment, or a note, and it's hard to figure out how to move them in between each one. So for example, if you as a clinician give a PTSD screener to clients, but you don't send it with your intake packet, you actually do it with the client, you don't want it to be in the intake packet. You want it to be under the assessment category. That's what I want to show you how to do today. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go to simple practice. You're going to log into settings. You're going to go to your notes and forms. And then you're going to see here, you have all the notes and forms and all that kind of stuff. And you'll also have access to the template library, which is up at the top right here. You can click that. Here's all the templates that Simple Practice has pre-populated. This is really helpful because there are tons of assessments here that would take forever to put in the system by yourself. However, you notice here that many of them come underneath the category of intake forms. Just for example, uh, I'm not a chiropractor, I'm a therapist, but let's use the chiropractic intake form as an example. Um, It's underneath the intake, but let's imagine I wanna do that with a client. So what you would do is go to the chiropractic intake form, you would click add, and then it will send it right to your own intake form. So now it brings you back to your notes and forms, which is right here. You're gonna click on the chiropractic intake form. It's going to bring you to the actual editor and the form itself. You're gonna go over here to the top where it says four intake forms. It's a drop down. You're gonna click it. You're gonna put it underneath assessments. You're gonna click save. It'll bring you back to your notes and forms. And then you'll notice that it's underneath the assessment section here. So that way when you see a client and you wanna do this with them, you can simply click on the assessments section in their chart and do it with the client. It is no longer part of the intake packet.